This is where the iconic Aro Hospital was located during the golden days of this mining township. However, all went into flames during the civil war on the island of Bougainville, with only skeletal remains of this infrastructure. However, medical care was provided using facilities of the Aro School of Nursing after the civil war and during the restoration period. Contractor Honeybrooks are working around the clock to complete the jobs before the commissioning of this new facility is co-financed by the Australian government and the autonomous Bougainville government. Peter Awin, who is the district health manager, is satisfied with the progress of work and thanked the people of Australia for the infrastructure development worth 19 million kina. Five new buildings. Uh, one is the extension of the maternity wing on the west wing and two, two new administration blocks, one which was a temporary theater and the other one is a family support center. And yeah, the project completion will be around mid-year this year, 2017. Although shipping services is a bit challenged with materials purchased on time, but arriving late in the autonomous region of Bougainville, his confident work will be completed on time. So that's why the project is being delayed at the moment. It's anticipated this new facilities and modern equipment funded by the autonomous Bougainville government with 4 million kina will boost performance and improve patient care. That theater, pathology, x-ray, uh, incinerator, all these equipments are being purchased. And a push for a new health facility, including the Arawa School of Nursing, became a reality when Dr. Velocity took this post in 2013. Dr. Velocity saw the need for a referral base for the people of Central and South Bougainville instead of going all the way to North Bougainville accessing services at the Booker Churl Hospital, the only referral base for the autonomous region of Bougainville, which is costly and time-consuming. Dr. Velocity says with this new service, it will improve patient care. However, with that, we also need uh, the improved number of staff. The staff issue is a big concern for us at the moment. Uh, we have seen staff exit from the service, and a lot of staff left us uh, well before crisis or in the midst of the crisis. Well, I would like to say that uh, with inf improved uh, infrastructure, uh, we would also like to see improved number of staff. In addressing the human resource crisis in the health sector, the Arawa School of Nursing was pushed to enroll students and that was simply to fill in the missing gaps, something Dr. Velocity says was a critical need for the autonomous region of Bougainville. We pushed for the school because we could see there was no way out. If we continue to recruit people, we don't have the surplus people outside to recruit. On top of that, we, we're coming out of a crisis situation and people will be reluctant to come back. And a challenge for all political leaders of Bougainville in the national government and also the autonomous Bougainville government to work together to embrace these opportunities and to move Bougainville forward as it prepares for its referendum come 2019. In Arawa, central Bougainville, Fabian Hakelitz, National MTV News.